as I said before, there can be quite a bit of confusion about criminalistics and forensic science. I've included in this lecture an article, actually a chapter, uh, from these two individuals, Jerry Chisholm and Brent Turvey, from their book, uh, Crime Scene Reconstruction, and they do a great job of dissecting and putting forth in simple terms and breaking down forensic science and the disciplines of criminalistics. So this isn't a PDF, so you can download this if you need to. I highly recommend that you do. As we scroll down, I want you to pay particular attention to this, this forensic science heading. Forensic science and the application of specific and scientific knowledge to, to criminal or civil cases. But more importantly, if you look, what's a criminalistics? And criminalistics includes all those particular specialized disciplines such as forensic biology and serology and chemistry and, and debris and pattern comparison. So forensic science is much like the umbrella of all these disciplines and underneath that umbrella falls what? Criminalistics. But again, you know, as I, I said before, don't be surprised if you're applying for a position and it reads criminalistics and it outlines all the duties that a crime scene investigator does. But the difference would be oftentimes criminalistics requires a hard science, like chemistry, biology, um, microbiology, um, or or organic chemistry and physical chemistry, PCHEM. So those are generally the differences. In addition, remember that there may be educational differences for forensic science or a crime scene investigator versus a criminalist. So you need to keep that in mind. But again, this particular article, this chapter does a great job breaking things down for you so you can get a, a better uh, overall view of forensic science and how it's related to criminalistics or actually vice versa. So don't uh, don't get confused and don't get you know too wrapped up into what one means versus what another one means. So just understand and appreciate that there is a direct relationship between the two.